This is how you put an image on your sketches slideshow and how you enlarge it, crop it, and bump up the contrast so that it shows up well on your slide. I'm gonna select from the insert menu, roll over where it says image, and go down to camera. Then I'm gonna hold up my drawing in front of my camera, get it as large as I can in the frame. Sometimes you have to hold it in a different spot to get the best image. But get as much of it as you can in there, as large as you can. And click the little yellow button. Once you've taken the picture, click here and insert. I'm going to enlarge it by dragging it from the corner. And since I don't want all this extra stuff in here, including my fingers and the side of my face, I'm going to click on the crop tool. And I'm going to crop out that information. And that information. And get it as tight as I can so that there's no extra stuff around the edges. And it's okay if you cut off a little piece of it because of the angle of the paper. I'm going to click over here to deselect it and click one more time. Now my image is in here. Notice how it's a little bit taller than it is wide. Since I want to get it as large as I can, I'm going to rotate the picture around like this. Click on it and then click this little handlebar at the top until the orientation is now wide. Now I can get it really large in here and I'm going to push it right to the edge of the picture and get this as large as I can. I could probably crop it even tighter here to get it larger because this is an angle. So I'm going to click it one more time. Click the crop tool. I'm going to pull this all the way up to here to the edge of where these leaves are and click again. And now I can get, even, get it even larger. Once I've got it as large as I can get it in here and cropped, I'm going to click on it one more time. Select Format, Format Options, and over here on the right hand side I'm going to click Adjustments and move the brightness over a little bit to the right until it lightens up. You don't want to go too bright on this because you'll, if you go too bright you'll lose your picture entirely completely. So I just want to bring it down like this. You can also play a little bit with the contrast. But just be careful. We want to be able to see the entire image as light on the white areas and as dark on the, in the contrast in this area. Then I'm going to click away here again. I'm going to select the title and I'm going to call this Patterns. I'm also going to add a number to it because I might have more drawings that don't fit on this page once I fill up that entire sheet. So that's how you add a photo. It's how you change the name and you increase the size of the photo and mess around with the adjustments until it looks just right.